Uh, I'm really glad to uh, be able to be here uh, with you today. Um, behind me is my good friend Lance Wood, who's going to tell you about another great program, NCF. So first, I'm going to say that um, 15 years ago, probably, a guy in this room, Brent Caldwell, said, come to the master's program, Lance. I said, no, I'm too busy. I was a tax partner at PricewaterhouseCoopers. A year after that, he said, hey, Lance, come to the master's program. You need this. I said, no, I'm too busy. And then God was on my heart, and so was Brent. <laughs> and I said, yes. And I started the master's program 10 years ago, and I sat next to Jeff, and it changed my life. It is one day a quarter for three years. If you're a man or you're a woman, it will change your life and put you on a trajectory to maximize your impact for the kingdom of God. And that's what I'm all about, maximizing impact for the kingdom of God. PwC kicked me out at age 60, mandatory retirement as a partner, but God had a plan. I landed at National Christian Foundation. National Christian Foundation helps generous people like you to be strategic about their giving and to do that in a tax-efficient way, and I love both of those things. I've got four quick points that are going to be really quick right now. The first is tax law update. You love to hear this. Against all odds, it appears there is not going to be any federal or California tax law changes this year, which was totally unexpected. So, you know, Build Back Better is dead on life support. Newsom's package to do single-payer health care like, and double the tax on all Californians to do that looks like it's dead, too. Okay. Three things about now. <laughs> For a tax guy, that's cool. Okay, three things about National Christian Foundation. First of all, if you don't have a donor advised fund, think about that. It is, I think of it as like a checkbook for your giving. You, you put the money there, you get a tax deduction when it's there, it organizes you, you can earn, you can invest it, then you give it out. It just organizes your giving and it does it in a tax efficient way where you can give securities, appreciated stocks, assets, and never have to pay tax on the gain. So if that's interesting, talk to me. If you already have a donor advised fund somewhere else, like with a secular fund, with a Christian fund, great. But if it's with secular place, help me out. Switch it over to National Christian Foundation. Last, last thing. If you know a person that's an entrepreneur with a business, that's a millions of dollars type business, or have appreciated real estate, there are some amazing things that you can do with that. The concept is the person's probably thinking, someday when I die, I'll give 10% of this at least to the kingdom. If you give it today with something they may not have thought about, you can do it in a way that doesn't disrupt your real estate or your business and get you a tax deduction today to offset your income that you're getting from this real estate or business, and you get 50% on the dollar tax refunds. Cash in your pocket, great for the kingdom. Thank you.